Hi Scorpio, welcome to Chelsea Love Tarot. I'm going to do your daily guidance reading. Hope everyone is doing well. And thank you for subscribing to my channel. I really appreciate your love and support as I'm growing my channel. Today is the 16th of June 2020, but if you come across this video by chance, this could also be a message for you if you resonated. Okay, Scorpio, one second. Let me check on the microphone. Sometimes I plug it in, but it's not like all the way in. And then, you know, and I don't have the best uh, sound audio. And that has happened today for, I think, four other signs that I did today, which I feel really bad about, but you can still hear me. But possibly needing a headphone. But Scorpio, let's get to your reading, okay? One second. All right. Spirits and angels, please show me accurate messages for Scorpio. Today, 16 of June, 2020. Some advice and guidance for Scorpio. Please show me. I feel like I need to take this. This has to come out. Unless it's long. Nope. Just one more. Scorpio. Okay, let me take a good look at the spread. There is a five of cups in reverse here. I feel like someone here is finally starting to realize that they're better off without this other person or this connection or this situation. Okay, roles can be reversed uh, in this reading and also, um, what was I going to say? Yeah, you could apply it to your love situation, family, friends. I feel like with the Eight of Wands in reverse, there's something like a, some sort of a communication of bad news about a certain home situation here, okay? Or a relationship. Because Four of Wands right here usually means relationships, a marriage situation, home situation, Twin Flame. But there is it, uh, Eight of Wands, it's in reverse. Someone could have been possibly juggling. Okay, there's a three of wands here. There's two of pentacles here. So usually these two cards also signify third party situation. I feel like somebody could have found out a certain information, okay, about someone juggling here and the third party situation. But I feel like you or the other person has turned your back on this situation because it's just too much burden here, okay? Ten of Wands. Turning your back on the burden. Turning your back on this burdensome situation. Someone has been juggling, okay? I do see um, the Scorpio, Pisces, and Cancer here. I also see some fire signs. Well, a lot of fire signs, actually. So it could be also dealing with a fire sign or a water sign like you, Scorpio, Pisces, or Cancer, or Leo, Sagittarius, or uh, Aries, okay? Let's take a look. Yeah, somebody is not being fair in this situation here. Could have also signified, I feel like, with the justice in reverse, could also mean, possibly mean, uh, possibly mean a divorce justice has something to do with legal situation legal issues marriage divorce but i feel like there could if you guys are married have been married before me oh now i'm seeing it somebody could have slapped somebody with a divorce paper that's the way the way i'm seeing it here now okay someone could have just sent somebody a divorce paper if you're married only applies to some of you but else, if that's not the case, then if you're just in a relationship, I feel like there's an ending in a relationship, okay? Something that maybe you thought could have ended up in a marriage, but it did not, okay? And here's the world card as well. Hermit in reverse. Magician card in the magician in reverse. Okay, somebody has made a very bad choice here, okay? Um, they They were confused and they were like, I feel like it wasn't the juggling thing. It was something. It was because they're not sure. Okay. I wouldn't say it was a spur of a moment, but I feel like they made a bad judgment call. 
there's no judgment card here, but I still feel like they made a bad judgment court call. It's just this card here too in reverse. Um, and they made the wrong choice. That's how I'm seeing it as well. And they not they didn't make such a wise choice because I see the hermit as someone very wise, someone very reasonable, someone experienced, who, someone who has a lot of experiences in life, or trying to seek from within, or seeking advice from other people. Just all around uh, being wise, okay. But I don't think this person is being wise in their decision. Uh, hence the hermit card is in reverse, and that was there's an ending here. There was an ending here. Magician card is also in reverse. I also feel like if you're going through some sort of a legal issues, uh, marriage, like a divorce, okay, doesn't if it's work situation, then someone is trying to pull a fast one on you, okay? So something that you have to be aware of. Um, but if it, this is regarding a marriage situ situation, like a divorce, I feel like also you need to be aware somebody might pull a fast one on you as well. Your partner, ex-partner is trying to pull a fast one on you as well. I don't think like this person is very mature. I don't think they are very wise because there is a Nine of Cups here. Initially, it was everything was hunky-dory, everything was romantic, and I'll be with you forever, I love you, blah, 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 but it turned out to be not the case. Most definitely, I see there is a case of a third-party situation. May or may not mean another lover, it could have other external inf interference as well, if this has something to do with work, so somebody else have interrupted your connection or has um metal into your connection leading to an ending okay or ending of a contract but if this is a love situation then i definitely see someone was not being very uh, honest here someone has been very deceptive because the magician card is in reverse the most de deceptive character that i can see that i know of of all <laughs> the entire cards in the entire deck um, next to the Seven of Swords. Hmm. Let's take a look here. Yeah, there was some spying. There was some spying going on. You could have probably found out a certain situation, information through some spying. And right now, I feel like there's some things that are put on pause right now, okay? Possibly not really speaking to each other. But I feel like Scorpio, there's still one major arcana card here. Oh, one, two, three. So I usually use the major arcana to give advice as in from the universe, okay? And the world card says it's time to end this cycle, okay? And start a new chapter in your life. Just this card, although you have been treated unfairly, but they will receive their justice karma, hopefully. Hopefully you can, um, hopefully if you're going through any legal issues that it will be more in your favor as in, you know, that you will benefit from it than not. But you have to be, be very careful what they have under their sleeves, you know, maybe you need to do a little bit more of spying. If you're going through a legal situation you want to win, I feel like you need to gain more information here, okay? Um, collect more information so you could win the court case. And also it's time to close this chapter and start a new chapter. Hermit card is also major arcana card. Make a very, very wise decision, okay? Also, I feel like also with the page of swords here, it's time to really look into matters in details like don't overlook the details because hermit card is to me it's a, a to as well everybody knows that the hermit card is a virgo so virgos are very analytical they are very detail oriented so there's certain details that i feel you shouldn't miss okay if there's a contract you need to sign a contract or sign a divorce people whatever the case is make sure that you look into the contract line by line okay and that there's no uh, hidden clauses is that what it is yeah haven't used that word in so long and also the magician cards in reverse so you have to be very careful of this character very sneaky and 
very deceptive so you have to be very careful okay and i feel like they're also strategizing about a certain something here thinking long and hard about how if this is not about some legal situation that could have just applied to a small group of you then maybe they are strategizing about you know how to go about starting a new uh, connection with you here okay here's the ace of wands uh, repairing something starting something new with you reconcile saying sorry it could also mean that okay there are two possibilities they are either being a magician trying to deceive you so they could win some sort of a court case legal case um, or they could just trying to deceive you <laughs> trying to sort of um, make you believe them again that things are going to be different this time around because of the ace of wands and i feel like they want to also offer you the ace of cups here i'm sorry let's start new this is the yep scorpio this is your message for today this is your reading your daily guidance reading i hope you resonated if you did please like share and subscribe I also do private reading. My number is in the description box below. And I hope to see you tomorrow, Scorpio. Take care. Bye.